Citalopram is a selective serotonin reuptake inhibitor, SSRI, used in the treatment of depression. In this video, let's find found. What is citalopram? What is citalopram used for? Contraindication. What are the side effects of taking citalopram? How does citalopram work? How to use citalopram? What is citalopram? Citalopram, sold under the brand name Celexa, among others, is an antidepressant of the selective serotonin reuptake inhibitor class. It is used to treat major depressive disorder, obsessive compulsive disorder, panic disorder, and social phobia. The antidepressant effects may tend to four weeks to occur. Citalopram was approved for medical use in the United States in 1998. It is on the World Health Organization's list of essential medicines. It is available as a generic medication. In 2020, it was the 31st most commonly prescribed medication in the United States, with more than 19 million prescriptions. What is citalopram used for? Citalopram is approved by the FDA for treating adults with major depressive disorder. It has also been used off-label to treat various diseases, including but not limited to sexual dysfunction, ethanol abuse, psychiatric conditions such as obsessive-compulsive disorder, OCD, social anxiety disorder, and panic disorder, and diabetic neuropathy. Contraindication Hypersensitivity Co-administration with pimazide Co-administration with serotonergic drugs Concomitant use or within 14 days of MAOIs increases the risk of serotonin syndrome. Side effects More common Change or problem with discharge of semen Less common Agitation Blurred vision Confusion Decreased interest in sexual intercourse Fever Inability to have or keep an erection Increase in the frequency of urination or amount of urine produced. Lack of emotion. Loss in sexual ability, desire, drive, or performance. Loss of memory. Menstrual changes. Skin rash or itching. Trouble breathing. Pharmacodynamic. Citalopram belongs to a class of antidepressants known as selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, SSRIs. It has been found to relieve or manage symptoms of depression, anxiety, eating disorders, and obsessive-compulsive disorder among other mood disorders. The antidepressant, anxiety, and other actions of citalopram are linked to its inhibition of CNS central uptake of serotonin. Serotonergic abnormalities have been reported in patients with mood disorders. Behavioral and neuropsychological effects of serotonin include the regulation of mood, perception, Reward, anger, action, appetite, memory, sexuality, and attention, as examples. The onset of action for depression is approximately 1 to 4 weeks. The complete response may take 8 to 12 weeks after initiation of citalopram. Mechanism of action The mechanism of action of citalopram is unclear but is presumed to be related to potentiation of serotonergic activity in the central nervous system, CNS resulting from its inhibition of CNS neuronal reuptake of serotonin, 5-HT, potentially through the inhibition of the serotonin transporter, solute carrier family 6 member 4, SLC6A4. Citalopram binds with significantly less affinity to histamine, acetylcholine, and norepinephrine receptors than tricyclic antidepressant drugs. Particularly, citalopram has no or very low affinity for 5-A1A. 5-HT-2A, dopamine D1 and D2, alpha-1-alpha-2- and beta-adrenergic, histamine H1, gamma-aminobutyric acid, GABA, muscarinic cholinergic, and benzodiazepine receptors. Half-life The mean terminal half-life of citalopram is about 35 hours. Dose Depression Depression in patients whose diagnosis corresponds most closely to the DSM-3 and DSM-3R category of major depressive disorder. Initial dose, 20 mg POQ day. If needed, may increase to 40 mg per day after at least one week. 
Doses above 40 mg per day are not recommended because of risk for QD prolongation without additional benefit for treating depression. Alcoholism, off-label. 20 to 40 mg POQ day. Binge eating disorder, off-label. 20 to 60 POQ day. Generalized anxiety disorder, off-label. Initial, 10 mg POQ day, may titrate to 40 mg per day. Panic disorder, off-label. 20 mg POQ day initially, after one week, may increase to 40 mg per day if warranted. Not seed 40 mg per day because of increased risk for QD prolongation. Hot flashes, off-label. Initial, 10 mg POQ day, may increase to 20 mg per day after one week. Obsessive compulsive disorder, off-label. Initial, 20 mg POQ day, may titrate to 40 to 60 mg slash day, improvement may be seen 4 to 6 weeks after initiating therapy. Premenstrual dysphoric disorder, off-label. 5 mg PO on the estimated day of ovulation, increased dose, by 5 mg each day thereafter, to maximum, mg. Continue thereafter until menstruation begins, decrease dose to 20 mg on the first day of menstruation, the next day, decrease to 10 mg. Stop the treatment from day 3 until ovulation begins. Safety Advice Advice and warnings for the use of citalopram, Celexa, during pregnancy. FDA pregnancy category C risk cannot be ruled out. That's all the information about citalopram we collected. Thanks for listening. Do not forget to like, share, and subscribe for the He Info channel if you like this video to update more health information.